up, YouTube? Welcome to Sin Take, man. My name is Jay Sin, coming back with another one, man. And it's a real quick one, man. Listen, y'all hear me say that it's all on you all the time. And I say that because generally it is all on you. It don't matter how many videos you watch, what you read, how much motivational shit that you into, how much red pill content you watch. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. School, you name it. You name it. Anything that you do, right? It's all on you. At the end of the day, it all falls on you. You could take in as much information as you want, but if it's not applied, then what does it matter? If you don't take heed, listen, you either you either choose to take heed of things or you don't. It's your life. You make your decisions. All you need to understand is that at the end of the day, you need to understand that, yo, you made your decision, so you got to live with it. It's nobody else's fault. You got a lot of people that, that will make these decisions, right? They will make the decisions that they want in their life. And then when it don't go their way, they, they find somebody to blame for it. Man, bro, it was all on you. Sister, chick, it was all on you. At the end of the day, it was ultimately all on you. So how some people like just be quick to, you know, to blame and bash and, you know, never take any accountability for their actions or responsibility. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, yo, they not, you know, they... Nobody ever want to hold themselves accountable. Like, yo, like, so you just going to find somebody else to blame when it all landed on you. It was all on you. And you made the decision you made. That's tough for people to handle. People like, listen, people don't want to listen. They don't want to take responsibility so bad. Right. They will try to find somebody to land it on before they do something you know what i'm saying they try to land it on you they 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 uh they are directed towards somebody before they do what they gonna do you know what i'm saying just to reiterate that just to reiterate that like hey okay so you so you sure like right like so this will you know this gonna do that and this gonna do this and this gonna do that and then i should be good right you know what I mean? That's like they 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 pre-blaming you, bro. Chicks that do it, men do it, they going to pre-blame you like, "Hey, hey, bro, like, yo, so, you know what I mean? Uh So you did this before, right? And then you saying that it worked. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You getting pre-blamed. Oh, so you, you know what I mean? So you talk to her and, and you know what I mean? So I mean, so it should be good then. You know, like they, like, listen, that's why you got to be careful, like, when you on the other side, bro. Because when you on the other side and you giving information or you or you call yourself putting somebody on or something, guess what? If it don't work out, they going to blame you. You got to watch out for people like that. It's people like that that do it, right? And, and it was like, yo, like, all I was doing was just telling you, like, hey, you know what I mean? I never had no problem with this person. I never had no problem going to this place. It was always cool. You know what I mean? I never had no problem dealing with them. It was always cool. You know what I mean? I ain't never had a, a bad experience there. You know what I mean? You just keeping it 100. I, man, I never had a problem with them. But guess what? They always got to find somebody to blame if it don't go right. So they will pre-blame you. They going to they gonna pre-hold you responsible even though they the ones that make the ultimate decision into what they doing you got to watch out for people like that no matter what even though you could give somebody the information all the information in the world at the end of the day they gonna make that final that final decision and if that final decision go left oh shit you know what that's why you got to be careful there's people out there that don't want to take responsibility for anything not even not in no parts that they play in it they don't want to take responsibility in that they don't so you got to check you got to you got you got to check yourself when it come to giving out information and, and when you call yourself putting people on and all of that because 
guess what? The person that you telling might be one of them type that like to blame the next person. You know, they not really with like, oh, you know what I mean? Like, damn, you know, okay, you know, whatever. You know, they, you could tell them something and they just like, like they gone. They gon' they gon' make their decision on it, but still though they gon' they gon' blame the source. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They gon' blame the source, like shit, man. You know what I mean? And then next thing you know, they hitting you up, like man, damn, damn, man. I went to that spot, man. That shit was bogus, bro. You can't even tell motherfuckers that you where where you ate at. You know what I'm saying? You had some good food at a at a Chinese restaurant. You said that shit was A1. They go have a different experience. Next thing you know, like, man, you bogus, bro. For what? Man, that shit was huff, bro. Like, man, that shit wasn't even, you know what I mean? They was bogus, motherfucker. Then, you know what I mean? I found hair in my shit. That shit was, you know. And they coming at you tough. Like, well, I'm sorry that you had a bad experience, motherfucker. You know what I mean? But, you know, you made your decision. That could have happened anywhere. You make your decision to go to that spot. That, like, guess what? You made the sole decision. You made the final fucking decision to go. It's not my fault that your experience wasn't like mine. So that's why you got to be careful with, 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 with who you appoint something to. Sometimes you just be like, you know, I ain't, man, that's the last time. You know what I mean? I know everybody that went through that shit. Like, man, that's the last time I'm putting that motherfucker on anything. You know what I'm saying? Because this motherfucker like to, you know, shit don't go his way. He gonna always find somebody to blame. Like, that nigga just gonna, you know what I'm saying? And at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? When you are a person that take responsibility and, you know, you accountable for your own actions, it be like, yo, okay, whatever it is, what it is. You know what I'm saying? But... Damn, you know, that's the last time I get your punk ass a referral, motherfucker, you know what I mean? Shit, you know, since it's like that, motherfucker, since your experience, and, and, and with motherfuckers like that, I'm telling you, man, they, you got to be careful with them with them cats that always look for something wrong with something. You know what I'm saying? You got cats like that that always look for the bad in things. You know? You know, a lot of people, like chosen ones. Yes, I'm going back to chosen ones. We could take the good and the bad from situations. Like, you know what? All right, they could have did better with the string beans, but that chicken was on point and their service was good. But motherfuckers that's always looking for the bad, they're going to take that green bean shit and just tear the whole restaurant down. Nigga, them green beans was huff. Nigga, why you tell me to go there? Like, damn, nigga, but you ate everything else, dog. Everything else. How was that shit, though? Nigga, I don't know, but the nigga, them green beans was bogus. You know, like, like, damn. I'm telling you shit no more. I'm telling you shit no more. You know what I mean? But yeah, man, that's just something real quick, man. I just wanted to share that with y'all, man. Motherfuckers be, motherfuckers always trying to find the wrong in something. They will. When you're dealing with a certain type of person, man, especially ones that be looking for the negative shit, guess what? If you go look for something negative, you're going to find it. Understand that before y'all give motherfuckers, before you uh, refer somebody to go, to go anywhere. Understand that. Understand who you're dealing with. When you're dealing with motherfuckers that's, that's, that's just prone to negativity, like they look literally like search for that one fault in something, you might not want to, you might not want to send them nowhere. You damn near wouldn't even want them hanging around your peoples because they always going to find something. And then motherfuckers want to look at you after. It's like, man, why you bring them motherfuckers to you? <laughs> First, I'm going to get on my grind. Then second, stop wasting my time. On shit less important. If ain't about money, I'm going the other direction. And third, I'm going to do what I got to eat. Fourth, I'ma sew up the streets. Fifth, I'ma never quit dropping this heat. So as long as I'm breathing, you better get used to me. Sixth, I'ma get.